Hello, and welcome to Empires of the Past. I am your host, the Pope, and this is my counterpart, the Bishop. Now, today we will be talking about the decline and the eventual fall of the great Roman Empire. You see, it is a very important topic that carries throughout history. Now, if you'll allow me, take a journey back in time. There are a variety of factors that contributed to the decline and eventually downfall of the Roman Empire, one of them being the bubonic plague, otherwise known as the Black Death. It was arguably one of the worst pandemics in human history. The plague was carried by fleas on the backs of rats who arrived in the empire via the Silk Road and merchant ships. The rats passed on the incredibly contagious disease onto humans, wiping out about 75 to 200 million people. Another of the major problems that led to the downfall of the empire was that the council had a hard time electing the new emperor, therefore leading to chaos in the government. Here is an example of what it may have looked like. It is obvious that our old emperor can no longer hold power. We must elect a new one. I should be the new emperor, for I am the richest and the most eligible. I should be emperor. I have a greater strength of men and armies. These men are nothing but tyrants. They use power and conquering to show that they are better emperors than anyone else. Well, what do I you are by bar barbaric and not loyal to Rome. What do I, any of you have compared to what we do? I know what I'm doing. What have you helped Rome? How do you think we have got I, this far? My we are actually successful. Possibly one of the worst blows that swept the empire was when the soldiers were busy holding back the Germanic tribes at the Rhine Danube front when a civil war erupted back in the heart of the empire. They were called back to help in the civil war, leaving the passage into Rome vulnerable. The Germans took this advantage and invaded the city. General. The Roman Emperor has a decree that you and your men come back to Rome. There's a civil war there. Retreat! Retreat! In the end, it fell, but the legacy of this once great empire lived on. It carried into the Renaissance and even today. We, in fact, get lots of our laws and government ways from them. Even though it fell, the Roman Empire will forever live on. Thank you for joining us on Empires of the Past. Now, what did you learn from this video? Ponder that for a while. Remember, two things. First, don't be like the Romans. And second... The bubonic blade kills people. Thank you for joining us. Have a good day. Battle, tell me!